it's very helpful to look uh, at myself. Discerning uh, missional leadership is uh, God's calling. Discerning missional leadership is paramount in helping leaders understand who they are, who their congregations will be, and who the church as a whole is. We see ourselves as providing a service to new worshiping community leaders and to the presbyteries so that that relationship can flourish. We, we look first uh, at the person themselves. Are they a spiritually mature person? And then secondly, we look at uh, missional behaviors. Do they have relationships with people outside of the church? And then thirdly, we look at uh, leadership capacities. Uh, can they grow and build a successful team? And lastly, do they have the ability to actually develop other leaders? When people engage in this assessment, they learn more than just about themselves as leaders. They, they learn about other people to uh, communities, how to go into a community. But they're hanging out with you at dinner. They're going with you trekking through a city. They're watching how you interact with people, people who are church, people who are not church. This is hugely important for the formation and to give you the foundation you need to stand on those tough days when you're planting a church and it's just you out there by yourself. A seminary education is amazing. I think it is one of the most valuable things that the, the Presbyterian Church values, right? But this process, we're stepping out on the streets and, and we're being very intentional about looking around ourselves. When is the last time you walked around your neighborhood and asked them, asked, asked your neighbors questions about what they need? I don't think it could be overstated how important it is to have self-aware leaders in the church. But especially for those who are deciding that, uh, that they believe that God is calling them into this work, that takes a lot of self-awareness, it takes a lot of training, it takes a huge cohort of people who you need to know are doing similar work. You know, I have a lot of like doubt within myself and I think something like this has been able to give me confidence to say, no, this is who you are. and you can go for this and God is calling you to this. And so to hear what other people uh, are asking of themselves and where God might be leading them is super encouraging to me. It's just been a beautiful thing to read scripture together, um, to have some uh, prayer time and to have some learning and to see the way that the Spirit is overlapping our stories. And that's only going to benefit the presbyter and presbytery and more than that it's only going to benefit the kingdom of God locally where that person is.